The question is whether NH43P, ammonium phosphide, is ionic or covalent. It's a little bit of a tricky one, so let's take a look at this. We see nitrogen, hydrogen, and phosphorus atoms in the ammonium phosphide compound. Nitrogen, hydrogen, and phosphorus, and they're all nonmetals. So when we have all nonmetals, we're expecting that we would have a covalent or molecular compound. But that's not the case with ammonium phosphide. That's because this NH4 here, this is what we call the ammonium ion. It's a polyatomic ion. The whole thing has a one plus charge. And you could draw the structure like this here. So we see we have our ammonium ion, and it has a positive charge overall. Phosphorus right here, that's in group 15, sometimes called 5A. It has a three minus ionic charge. So you can see where we have this ammonium ion with the one plus, we have three of them, that balances out the three minus. So this is an ionic compound, these positives and this negative charge here, they're attracted to each other, that's what forms the ionic bond. So you really just need to memorize that ammonium, that's the NH4 plus, the ammonium ion, and when it bonds with other nonmetals, it forms ionic compounds. This is Dr. B answering the question whether NH43P, ammonium phosphide, is ionic or covalent. It is ionic. Thanks for watching.